Salutation Spartans, my name is Patatronic, and welcome back to Hogwarts Legacy. We are just going to hop right back into this. In the last episode, we did our practice dueling, and we got obliterated like three times. Three, four, fifty times. But uh, now we got to go talk to Sebastian. So we're going to do that. And I now Sebastian know... Sebastian mentioned sneaking into the restricted section. Perhaps he'll have an idea. No, we're going to be sneaky. Protego! That's not what I wanted. Lumos. Guess I'm following this moth somewhere. Oh no, I gotta burn it somewhere. That's right. Um, I don't know where the thing is. Is this that? What are you up to now? I don't know. Is it? Uh, I don't know where the thing is. <laughs> Would it show on my map? I don't think so. Burn them off somewhere. I know there was that one mirror that I do most. But uh, as I was saying, I now know how to do the doors, the number doors. Uh, if I come across one, I'll show you. No? Yeah. Yeah, there you go. No, that was the right one. Sweet. Nice. Okay, now what are the odds I could find one of the doors again? Probably very slim since this is a big arse school. No, I don't want to go there. Let's see. Well, Sebastian's right there. Um. Oh. <laughs> I was actually just told about this picture. I'll explain that in uh, just a moment. I want to try and find... Do they show up on the map? I don't know if they do. I want to try and find... What's this? No. I honestly have no idea where they'd be. Well, if I come across one during this uh, video, then I'll do it, but I know how to do them now. Just doing one more quick little glance over. All right, Sebastian. All right, this, uh, <laughs> this right here, it, uh, Rebellion. I might have already gone this before unless Sebastian's going to tell us about it. Uh, I'll, I'll, I'll say it after this because I don't know what he's going to say. Sebastian, there you are. I was hoping to see you. I was in the Three Broomsticks after the troll attack and saw what happened with Rookwood and Harlow. Not many students have Victor Rookwood's attention. What was that all about? It's to do with Renrock? I'm not entirely certain. Um... Do I still keep on playing the idiot? Um, yeah, I told Natty, so. Seems he's working with Ranrock. I think. Ranrock is after something I found at Gringotts. Ranrock? And when were you at Gringotts? Professor Fig and I ended up there after the dragon attack. It's quite the tale. Fig had this port key. A port key? To Gringotts? I'm not sure I follow. I barely follow myself, and I was there. Anyway, we ended up in an ancient vault where we found a map. That map leads to the restricted section. Okay, you said you way can't too be much. Serious. Deadly serious. Professor Fig has insisted that I not tell a soul about any of this. I've probably said too much. Yeah. Understood. Your secret's safe with me. Whatever it is. It better be. Thank you, Sebastian. You mentioned being clever enough not to get caught in the restricted section. And I am. Meet me outside the library tonight and tell no one. Uh, what if we're caught? What will happen if we're caught in the restricted section? Detention, no doubt. But a word of caution or two will help. For one, avoid Peeves, the poltergeist. Aside from wanton destruction of property, he loves nothing more than telling on the likes of us. All right. How concerned should I be about the librarian? Madam Scribner doesn't take kindly to clandestine activities taking place amongst her precious books. So do all that you can to avoid her. She and I have had our entanglements, but I can hold my own against her. 
you may not be so lucky. All right. Thank you, Sebastian. I'll meet you later. Maybe I shouldn't have told them that much. Oh, are we just... Meet Sebastian in the central hall at night. Um... All right, right there, eh? I want to try and find a door. Well, we'll carry on. Anyways, that painting that was in front of him, there's a rumor going around that that looks like J.K. Rowling. Oh! But, uh, yeah. I, I can't remember what the actual witch's name is called. All right. See there? That's the door we need to reach. Okay. And those annoying prefects would love nothing more than to rat on us to Scribner. So don't let them see us. Understood? I can be sneaky. Let's go. Hold on now. There's a spell you should know. The disillusionment charm. Good for getting places you're not supposed to be. Cast it and you'll appear as little more than a trick of the light. Just as long as you keep your distance and stay quiet. You mean I'll actually be able to turn invisible? Something like that. It's not as foolproof as a cloak, but those are expensive. And spells, spells are free. Give it a try. What's it called? Actually, you just said it. <laughs> Never mind. All right, let's try this. Beautiful. Del delusionment. Use delusionment to avoid being detected in off-limit areas. Okay, first I have to equip it. So where is it? Is it? Yes. Um, I'll get rid of... I guess I'm not using Incendio at the moment, so we'll get rid of that. Nearby adversaries will sense and investigate suspicious behavior. Being caught by authority figures will result in quest failure. I guess just take my time then. Okay, we're safe from her. Oh, I was really hoping that'd be a distraction to lead them over here. This is actually pretty cool, I ain't gonna lie. Isn't she gonna see me open the door? Or he? I can't tell from this distance. <laughs> really? You're not gonna say anything about that? Blast. The librarian's still here. Quick, behind the bookcase. Told me the librarian would be gone by now. I said usually, but it'll still be all right. Do you see her desk behind me? The key is in the drawer of that desk. Now, here's what we're going to do. I'll create a distraction to draw her away. You focus on getting the key. I'll meet you outside of the restricted section. Why do we need the key? Obviously to get into the door. Good idea. You distract, I get the key. Understood. I said I'd get you in, and I always keep my word. Trust me. All right. I gotta sneeze. 
Better is someone there? I knew it hurt someone. Out with you! What the heck? I saw the thing going up, but a panic quest. Try again. Okay, well, that kind of sucks. Jeez, yeah, let's just show us off like that. Is someone there? Is that you, Peeves? Is someone there? The library's closed until morning. Must have been one of the books wandering about. Okay. Go, 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 go. Oh my lord. Pick it up. Professor Black, might I suggest a ban in the magic library? Someone has been sneaking into the restrictions section, and Chrissia Bloom seems to be thinking... The, seems to think of the library as her own personal area in which to practice her latest incantations. It is most disruptive. One might consider peeves tame by comparison to such antics. The key. Here it is. Where? Better. The library oh. is no place for larking about. Out at once. Oh man, I was just about to say, where is she? Oh man, okay. I honestly did not see her there. Third time's a charm, right? Get it? Because we're casting the charm. Alright. Oh my god, Sebastian, what are you doing? There's someone there. Is that you, Peeves? He's being a peeve. The key. Here it is. Okay, go. Beautiful. That wasn't so difficult after all. How to find that book. Spooky. What was this? Oh, that one's charm to look more useful than it is. It's fooled me twice. Never judge a tone by its cover, I say. <laughs> Revelio. I like that he actually whispered that, too. Use basic cast while undetected to lure authority figures and enemies to a desired location. Okay, there you go. Aim L2 grants precision spell targeting and reveals additional spell targets. Beautiful. Ghost, don't let her see you. I guess a ghost can see someone invisible, can't they? Okay, go, 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 go. Should be in the clear. There's no need for us to be skulking about. So oh. what is it you've been looking for? I'm looking for a cure to help my twin sister, Anne. Revelia, so she can return to Hogwarts. Because Merlin knows everyone. Tart. Enchanted books. Best to avoid these books if possible due to a... Do not as much to their tendency to fly from one's hand as to their content being spectacular drivel of no educational value whatsoever. Why do you think we'll find a cure in the restricted section? Does the Hogwarts matron have nothing that can help out? No. We've tried everyone from Nurse Blaney to St. Mungo's. But I can research on my own. No need to concern yourself with that right now. Let's focus. Rebellion. Which is what, precisely? I'll know it when I see it. You're being awfully cryptic. <laughs> well, it's because I'm the only one that could see it. 
I really wonder how to get rid of the, uh, those chests there. Revelio. Pretty. I'll be quieter than a jobber Than a what? Sorry, I just... Would like to know what that sound was. Levioso. Who have we here? Sebastian Solo and his new little friend. Out exploring where they shouldn't be. Naughty, naughty. You'll get caught. Peeves, don't you... Got to stop him, or at least get to the librarian with a good excuse for all of this. Don't get into trouble. Can I trust you? Don't get into trouble. Wait, I don't want you getting into trouble for me. I have a way with the faculty when it comes to disciplinary matters. Besides, I like having friends who are in my debt. Now go. Good luck in your search. Now, where has that damned poltergeist got to? <laughs> I know just the spell to repair this armor. Nope. I guess I don't have a uh, Reparo re equipped at the moment. Where is it? Nope. Right there. Um. Sure. Reparo. So that was Peeves that done that. I wonder if I could go about that a uh, different way. Let me actually put that on. Okay, I'll keep what I have. Revelio. Of course, traces of ancient magic. There must be more to this room. That's it! I'm here in Avada Kedavra. Ooh. Grab that first. I feel like I'm gonna have a fight on my hands here shortly. So you know what? Get rid of Reparo and put, uh... Levioso back on there. Oh. Ancient mysterious scarf. Where might this lead? Let's find out. Maybe I need Reparo again. <laughs> okay. Uh, well. Reparo. Hey. Ah, I need to wake up that rune over there. All right. I only have one health potion. Oh boy. Not surprising. Guards at the ready. Luckily it pauses there. Um. Incendium. Levioso. Ah, yeah. Went to dodge. Dude. 
так. Gift of Angel Magic accumulates by successfully attacking or taking damage. Successful 10 hit combos will begin generating ancient magic power ups. Collecting these will greatly fill your ancient magic meter and recover a small amount of health. When at least one segment of your ancient magic meter is full, you can cast devastating ancient magic attacks that deal massive damage and break shield charms. Tap L1 and R1 when you see the prompt over an enemy's head. Yes, I already saw that. How much does my health regenerate? Or does it just go all the way up to full? Ah! Right as I go to dodge too. Let me hurt Incendio. Oh, what's all this? Hidden staircases to the chest. Your gear slots are full. Sell or discard excess gear to... Okay, crap. So I guess I have all that now, eh? Uh, gear. <clears throat> well, I'll keep what I have. If I come across something, I'll, uh... Dispose of it, I guess. Hello? do this. What the heck? Can I just like charge across it? Let's try that. I don't have a spell for this, do I? I vacuum. Lumos. Forgetting something that I have. Whoop. I don't 
don't know if that's how I was supposed to get about that, but I made it. This must be the way forward, but to where? Who knows? Incendio! Those feel like they have to be set on fire. Lumos! Incendio! Oh yeah, I can jump. Oof, I forgot about that. Nearly there. Best keep my wits about me. Oh yeah. Well. <clears throat> what do I have that's like weak weak? Gear slot. I don't know what that is for. Well, might as well destroy that. That doesn't sell for anything. That sells for quite a bit. Boom. Jumper glove. And another chest. Oh boy, I should have sold when I was in Hogsmeade. Gray Quidditch gloves. They're actually worse than what I have. Oh, that's just lovely. I'm just barely scraping by. Well, I guess that's what I get for playing on horror, don't I? Wonder. It is a book after all. Revelio. Okay. How far back do we go?
Those be some powerful wizards. Wanted to see me, Headmistress Fitzgerald, Professor Rackham. Miss Isadora Morganach, welcome. Professor Rookwood, Professor Bacar. We understand that you are adjusting well to life at Hogwarts. I am. I am glad. Especially in light of your unusual situation, starting as a fifth year. As it happens, I was also admitted to Hogwarts as a fifth year. I've never heard of another like us. Oh, so I'm not Miss Morganock, when we spoke yesterday after class, you asked about the beautiful swirls you saw years ago when we visited your hamlet. I recognized you all immediately. I cannot thank you enough for what you did. We were glad to help. And yes, I did see swirls of magic everywhere that day. My father insists it was my imagination running wild, but... It was certainly real to me. It was not your imagination. Percival, Professor Rackham can see them too. But we have never known of another who could. I don't understand. What are they? The whispers or traces that appear when a particular form of ancient magic is wielded. Ancient magic? Few are capable of wielding it. Hogwarts itself is a stronghold of ancient magic. So if I can see traces of ancient magic, does that mean I can wield it too? With the proper training. But let us not get ahead of ourselves, Miss Morganach. Before I can train you to wield such magic, you must first master all that Hogwarts has to offer. A magic this powerful can do great harm in the wrong hands. It must be wielded by a select few. As such, we ask that you not speak to anyone about what we have discussed here today. Well, she didn't say anything. She's gonna go tell everyone. Alrighty, I thought I was the only one. I'm not special. Sebastian. Sneaking in the restricted section again! I had thought we were through with this mischief. Clearly, detentions are insufficient. I'm afraid I must take this to the headmaster. But that being said, Peeves informs me that you didn't come alone tonight. If someone has coerced you, I would have you tell me. You're a bright boy. Don't waste this. There was nobody else. I came alone. Oh, Sebastian. What will your uncle say? <laughs> Who's your uncle? Um. So am I safe? Secrets of the Restricted Section. I guess I'm safe. So what's my next step now? What's this? Wait, return to Professor Fix class. Wait, what am I waiting for here? Oh, you? Where are you? <clears throat> Cressidia Bloom? Is everything all right? Oh, hello. Thank you for asking. I'm Cressida, by the way, uh, and I'm afraid everything's not all right. I may be in a spot of trouble with the librarian. You see, I'm fond of creating my own charms. Thought I'd perfected my light as a feather charm to use on my library books. My arms get so tired carrying them around all day. 
but I must have confused the Latin word for feather with bird in my incantation, because when I opened my bag just now in the library, they literally took flight. <laughs> That's amazing. Seems like a lot of work just to carry books. That's amazing. That sounds brilliant, actually. Thank you. Somehow I don't think the librarian will see it that way. I collect the books and remove the charm myself, except this isn't the first time one of my charms has threatened the peace of the library. Our meat told Madame Scribner they were my books flying around, so she said that if I caused her any more trouble, she'd write to my parents. Perhaps you could get them for me. There are only five. She won't be suspicious of a new student looking around. Why did Amit tell on you, Amit? Why did Army tell Madame Scribner that they were your books? Oh, to be perfectly honest, I don't think he meant any harm. I think he was impressed, bragging on my behalf. Amit spends a lot of time gazing at the stars, but he knows a good charm when he sees one. No. Nope. I suppose I could help, if I have the time. Oh, I'd very much appreciate it. One of the books is my diary. I'd rather it not fall into the wrong hands. I'm gonna read it. If you could collect them and bring them to me, I can remove the charm. I'm gonna read it. All right, flying off the shelves. All right, back in. Back in we go. I'm going to have to use Akio to get to those books. That is correct. So, that is right here. Akio! Got it. Only four more to go. Reading can be as magical as any spell. Why can't students see that? I mean, I like to read. Hard to believe since some of the words I mess up. All right. Oh, hello. Lumos. <clears throat> okay, so should be in the library. It's actually that guy right there. Akio. Revelio. Yeah, the moth, moth is right there. The old librarian. One of the first librarians of Hogwarts is depicted here. Rumor is that he had no tolerance whatsoever for noisy students and was known for his liberal use of silencing charms at the slightest sneeze. Alrighty. Lumos. Let's bring you back to your painting. Or the mirror, I should say. Alright, how many more books do I need to get? Three, two, thirty-two. Per Augustus, uh... Accio! Hmm. This must be Cressida's diary. Oh. I'd want this back too if I were her. Today was a good day. That is, until Gareth splashed whatever ridiculous concoction he was creating all over my perfectly stewed lace wing flies had to empty my entire cauldron and start all over again he is such a menace thinks he knows everything there is to know about potions always disrupting professor professor sharp's class with his experiments i'm utterly convinced that if it wasn't professor weasley's nephew he wasn't professor weasley's nephew he would have been expelled by now arboroth smokes smoke geese again tonight for dinner I'm becoming more partial to them now, although I still prefer meat pile. Any spell? Why can't students see that? Accio. At all of them? No, that's four out of five. There's one more now. I will find it. I will look for you. I will find you. And I will catch you. Got to be up there. T 
Damn, I'm noisy. Revelio. Huh, where's this last book? chest oh, I, I should go to Hogsmeade as well sell my stuff I just gotta find this last book did I just see it there Accio. that's the last book now to take them back to Cressida all right move I just realized I have Accio twice I'm coming back, Cressida. Hello, Cressida. I collected your books, including your diary. Oh, what a relief. Thank you. I'll happily take the heavy lot off your hands now. Perhaps a reward to keep the diary a secret? No, I'm not going to say that. Here you are. Well, lesson learned. I certainly won't be practicing any charms in the library again anytime soon. Now, to work out where I went wrong. Perhaps I should start brushing up on my Latin. Yeah, I'm not oh, going to do that. Some people are trustworthy. Certainly wouldn't want anyone but me. Sorry. Repair room. Do I need something else for that? Maybe I gotta fill it up with water? Um, I might actually... To finally have an answer as to why that he tried to study in the library. I might actually go to uh, Hogsmeade here. So I can sell some stuff. Uh, fast travel, that's a thing. Hogsmeade map. I don't think it matters who I go to. Uh, actually, potions. Yes, let's go to him. I don't want that, I want travel. Fast travel, yo. Make it quick so you don't have to sit through me walking the grounds. Indeed, here I come. Yes. We are here. Uh, I want to get to Pippin, please. Yo, Pippin, what's popping? No, oh, right across from me. Oh, boy. Welcome. Do let me know if I can be of any assistance at all. You can be. I'd like to sell some stuff. Very good. Never hurts to keep my stocks replenished. I might as well sell as much as I can. I'm... Uh, maybe. I'm only going to sell the ones that have, like, no magical properties. And that are also level 1. What do I have equipped? Does it show what I have equipped when I burn it here? Ooh, I'm gonna put that on. Oh, Maybe I'll put that on. Okay, hold up. Hold up, Pippin. I hope to see you again. Farewell for now. I'm not leaving. What was neckwear? Oh. Put that on. Well appointed, legendary. I'm gonna get rid of that one, I guess. Gloves. Get rid of the Quidditch ones, I guess. Do I have any headwear? No, I don't. Wand handles. I do have some of this. Hmm. Do I have a better cloak? I don't think I do. Alright. 
What can I do for you today? You? Contain. Okay, so no, it doesn't show the ones that I have equipped. Which is good. Can I buy them back if... I don't think so. I'll keep some of them. What's all this? Okay. Focus potion. Thunder. Oh, the real. Okay. Oh, wait, do I get three for this? A wise decision. Thank you. I can only buy three. Might as well. I hope to see you again. Farewell for now. All right. And I believe... That should probably just right about wrap it up now. Let's go back to Hogwarts here. We're going to Professor Fig, eh? Let's travel here. I would like to come across one of those doors so I can showcase it for you all. Might have to wait for the next episode for that one. Well, there's the one that I already did. <laughs> that doesn't help me. Where'd that go? Well, I might search around a little bit <clears throat> and see if I could find another one of those doors so I could showcase on how to do it. So if I come across another one, I'll see you then. If I don't find one within the next, like, 12 minutes, I will stop. So, yeah. Oh, I found a chest. I can tell you that much. Never mind, it's locked. All right. Oh, Rebellion. I got ourselves a field guide page here. Lachlan the Lanky. The statue depicts the wizard Lachlan the Lanky, a tall, slender wizard who appears quite proud of himself for what precisely no one knows. Hey, there you go. Now level 11. Beautiful. Gotta love to see it. We beg silence of you. Why? Okay, what's this? What the heck? What did I just do? Teleported. Ow. Okay. That was weird. Uh-huh. Because no one likes you, Peeves. There's a cat right there. Hey, another potion. Nice. Got four of them now. Oh, I found a new flu flame. Rebellion. Thought that would have one. Honey Duke's passageway. Hidden behind the statue of a one-eyed witch is a secret passageway from Hogwarts to the cellar at Honey Duke's. It can only be accessed using a particular charm. I see. Okay, now we got... Moving stairs. I can't find another door. The path you walk is precarious. You should return to me often for guidance. Do you like help me? Oh wait, there's a flu flame up here. Might as well grab it. There you go, Grand Off Staircase. On another adventure, are we? Absolutely, I never stop. I'm just looking for a darn Rebellion door so I can showcase it. The Hogwarts Ar Architect. The Hogwarts Architect shown here surrounded by the four horse mascots designed and oversaw the construction of Hogwarts Castle alongside founder Rowena Ravenclaw who was credited with creating its ever-changing floor plan. Alright. Ah, there we go. Alright. So, I was doing it wrong. It doesn't start with one. It starts at zero. So, I was doing it all wrong. So, we got a... F so, some to make 
six there. So zero, one, two. Yeah, two. And we need... Uh, zero, one, two. Actually, wait. It's the same picture as the one that's above. There. So that makes six. Right? Alright, now where's the other one? Well, hold on. So five and one, and we need eleven. So one, the six, one, two, three, four, five. We need a five. Zero, one, two, three, four, five. So that weird looking spider thing. Revelio. Oh, okay, it's down there. Revelio is nice and handy. How nice to see you, my young friend. Oh, I passed it. Okay, now that should literally be the answer. Let's see if I'm right. What? Am I messing up with this this one here? Oh, wait, no, give me the owl, because that's zero. Since six is already there. There you go. Okay. Okay. Really? That's a downgrade. Well, there. I finally got to showcase my darn door stuff. Rebellion. Yeah, that makes sense that there's a page here. House Point Hourglass. These large, ornate hourglasses containing rubies, diamonds, sapphires, and emeralds are enchanted to keep count of house points for Gryffindor, Hufflepuff, Ravenclaw, and Slytherin, respectively. So, who's winning? Can't tell. Is that another door there? I think it is. Oh. Mm -hmm. I whacked him in the face. Am I able to get over, over there? Yes, alright, we'll do this one too. Oh man. Alright, so the first one. So that should be nine plus seven. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Sixteen. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So the first one should be the spider. I suck at math. I have to use my fingers for this. Alright, spider. And then 11, owl 0, so we just need 3. 0, 1, 2, 3, the hydra. I saw it right here. Beautiful. Okay, thank you for hitting me, door. I appreciate that. Is there even a point for me opening these? Everything's, like, worse than what I already have. Revelio. Nothing else in here? All right. And I think with all that being said and done, I showcase me opening two doors. Oh, I'm in the... the hall, aren't I? Yeah. Actually, there might be a page up here. Yes, there is. Owl le Lectern. This enchanted lectern serves as a spot from which the great headmistresses and headmasters of Hogwarts, as well as Professor Black, address the school. It's my turn now. We are gathered here today. Oh, that I can Oh, that I can <laughs> Okay. Anyways, I think this is a good spot for me to stop it here. So thank you everyone so much for watching. In the next episode, we're going to go to Professor Fig and see exactly what he has to Rebellion. say to us. So thanks for watching. Take care. Bye-bye, everyone.